diagnosed in 1993 uh, and uh, that was uh, 10 years before it progressed any further. I just felt a little bit lethargic. I was surprised to find out it was hepatitis. Um, apart from anything else, when I found out more about hepatitis, I wasn't in any of what's considered the high risk groups. I still thought perhaps the tests would be negative and it would be something else, but we all know now it was hepatitis. I wasn't aware that there was a link uh, with cancer. Uh, once I was under the care of a specialist, she did tell me that at that time there was a slightly increased risk. Uh, but she did say, I still don't expect you'll get it. But um, uh, we were all surprised that 10 years later that I was, um, I was diagnosed with uh, liver cancer, a large tumour. I was aware of a stigma attaching to hepatitis and um, the fact is that um, this is uh, not only silly but can be dangerous because uh, people should, if they have any thoughts at all that they may have hepatitis of any sort, then they should be tested even if they're feeling well because treatment is what they need and uh, treatment can really help. big push for vaccination. Um, I think it's still three uh, injections and after that it's really important to have the test to make sure that it's taken. Make sure you're protected. There's no point in having the injections and then maybe you're not because that's what happened to me. If people then find they have hepatitis then they should be screened regularly for liver cancer because uh, early treatment is what saves people like me. Go and get tested, please. <laughs>